Hi, and welcome to That's So Nova. Um, today, I am really excited because I got my little email from YouTube saying, Hey, Nova, you did, you have 500 subscribers. And I totally flipped out and I'm super excited. Um, thank you, every single person that has to subscribe because that means so much to me because it feels like I'm doing my goal. My goal is I really want to teach people like tips and tricks that I have learned throughout the years and certain things that my Avalika taught me I want to be able to teach because she's no longer here but I feel like teaching some of the tricks that she taught keeps her memory alive for me and as well is help the sewing community because at the end of the day that's what I want to do. Um, so I'm going to hold host a little giveaway i'm not like over yet we're like you get a car you get a sewing machine i wish <laughs> so what i what i'm doing instead is i created i well i have a leather stocking that says happy holidays and it's full with little goodies and tricks and little little things that I'm, and some some things i'm still going to add like candy because i feel like that needs to be in every seller's room um and i wanted to do a giveaway um it's not massive it's a small one there's no nobody sponsored this. this is everything that i purchased on my own i like to buy a lot of notions from like zippers to needles to thread so sometimes what i do is i buy duplicates of something so that way when i had a chance to host a giveaway i would have a lot of stuff so um with that being said i'm going to start show what's in this holiday stocking and then I will explain the rules to enter the contest and how long it'll be for. So I'm going to change the camera view magically to the, <laughs> to, let's see, I got it right, <laughs> to this right here. So this is all leather stocking and it says happy holidays on the stocking. And inside the stocking, I have, like I said, a little bit of notions. So let's take some things out. Where I have some handmade tags that um, you could put on your handbags, etc., your pouches or whatever that say handmade. Sometimes I like seeing little tags because I make, I just make it. It makes the bag feel or whatever item feel good. Like I have, I stamped Happy Holidays on this stocking, so I'm really proud of it. I have some size three zipper tape from Emmeline Bags. I have a Jack Skeleton <laughs> ornament, and that is because I I love the holidays and if you have that in your craft room then I feel like a little part of me is there with you. Um Laura Mormino has the cutest bag tags like sewing labels and I get all of her um labels because they're really fun to add a little pop by the pocket and this one says uh you look really pretty today and I think that is like amazing to have on your um inside your bag low hand lotion so when i did the room tour it was a brief one but before i go uh, live with you or when i before i sew i have nivea cream that i put on my hands because fabric dries out your hand whether it's leather synthetic leather cotton canvas whatever it is it pulls moisture from your hands and you i just believe in replenishing it and there's this this one's called is uh sugar from sugar russian it's called cake butter it smells really good. I'm really sensitive to smell and I have really sensitive skin and this doesn't bug me and it smells like cake. It's just amazing. I always have a regular ballpoint pen and for in my, by me to document notes or sometimes if I know it's going to be on the wrong side of the fabric and it won't bleed and it won't be seen, I'll draw it on there. A really cool thing, um, someone brought this to my attention and I bought them recently. These are marking tools. Now, you have one fourth of an inch, three inch, a half an inch, five eighths an inch, and three fourths. What you do is you can stick your pencil or your pen in this thing, in the hole. And when you trace around the area that you want, like even a curve, it'll give you whatever, um, whatever marking you want. So like, so this is a curve, right? This is a curve right here. You could put one of these on here and trace a five eighth of an inch seam or, uh, trace your, um, where you want your stitches to go so you can have perfect stitches. If you watch my videos, you know I am really big about drawing the lines, the stitch lines, so I can get accurate stitching. It's not cheating. To me, it's it's leveling up. 
I also have hand sewing needles. Um, I know this is sometimes the bane of somebody's sewing existence, but I feel like you need to become one with hand sewing, especially if you want a clean lining. Sometimes a little hand sewing um, can make a visible stitch and it look, can make it look seamless. And I just always have hand needles on hand, especially if I pull threads to the back or whatever I do, I always have hand needles. I just had to sew this little guy's hat back on. So <laughs> hand needles are, are a plus for me. I, I'm constantly buying that. Buttons. Um, I have a collection of buttons and I'm going to start doing a Nova's Notions or Nova's Knowledge of Notions. I haven't figured out the name for it. Like on either Wednesdays or Fridays, it'll be like a small snippet. But if you go through my drawer, I have a ton of buttons. Sometimes a button inside a pocket can be a nice accent or outside. I love buttons. I always find a cool use for them. And I just think they're an amazing um, sewing asset. There's more things in here, I promise. Uh, a silver marking pen so that you can draw on your leather or your um, synthetic leather, your cork, and then you can wipe it off. And last but definitely not least, if you watch me enough and you know I love glue, one of my favorite glues is Gray Check. I put this on back of all of my hardware when I'm doing slits or whatever, so that way the fabric doesn't fray and, some, and it adheres the hardware really well to it. So all of this comes in my um, handmade leather uh, stocking that I made. And I am so happy that I'm able to get it, give it to somebody. I love giving gifts for the holidays. And I'm really excited that I'm at 500 subscribers. Uh, my wish for this Christmas is I really would like to get to a thousand subscribers because once you get to a thousand, you can do lives. So whenever I'm sewing a bag, whether it's for an order or for a strike or for whatever, I can go live and you can see and you can talk to me and ask me questions on what I'm doing. And I love doing lives. Most of, <laughs> most of my, um, Sewing tutorials or back tutorials are, are hardly ever edited because one, we're not, me and my husband are not the best at editing. We're getting there. <laughs> we're getting there. But, and two, I, once I start sewing, I really can't stop. It's a, it's a weird thing. I have to finish the actual project that I'm doing. Super weird. I know. So let me explain to you what you need to do to win this stuffing full of goodies. Um, one, you need to subscribe that will automatically get you a ticket Two, you need to comment down below. The question I have is out of this, out of this stocking, what is your favorite item in this stocking? And my second question would be if I get to a thousand subscribers and I will stay able to get some other things. I've had some other companies reach out to me. If I get to a thousand subscribers, uh, to donate to my giveaway, um, what would you like to see? Would you like to see different colors, zipper tape? Would you like to see zipper pull, scissors? What would you like to see? And I just, I'm, I'm just really curious. So those two questions, one, what was your favorite item? Two, what's your favorite giveaway? That will get you another ticket and liking will get you a third. Now to get additional tickets, if you tag people into this, on this YouTube video, each person you tag will get you an additional ticket. This, pro this is going to be open. This YouTube video will be open until December the 3rd. On December the 3rd, I will draw a name on a short video um, and announce the winner. Reach out to the winner, and I want to mail this out no later than December the 6th to ensure that you get it before the holidays. Again, I want to say thank you to every single one of my subscribers. I couldn't do this without you, and you guys made a mini goal of mine. I'm at 500 subscribers. That's outrageous. And I'm super excited and, and I appreciate you giving me the opportunity to teach different things. So I'm going to say it one more time, like subscribe and comment. What was your favorite item in the stocking and what would you want to see in a future giveaway and tag a friend and get extra points closes on December 3rd on December 3rd. I will close all the comments on this post and I will announce the winner. Um, December 4th. So December 3rd at midnight at Eastern Standard Time, the comments will be closed. Um, I keep saying, um, it's a bad filler. So if, 
I really appreciate everything. And until we meet again, happy sewing and happy holidays. Bye.